Wow, I just built the most amazing workflow on Monday.com. You build your own workflow? Why? There are a bunch. We're going to do this a little different. Mm. Hey, guys. Make sure y'all tap the screen. Let's get this collective started. Shanty. Ching, ching, ching goes the money tree, and every time a ching money comes to me, it all flows in so abundantly from the top, right, left, and under me. Nourish your temple, and then we also have creating art. And then we also have connecting with y'all crystals. So if you have crystals, connect with your crystals. And I hope you're having a great day. I washed my face. So I hope everybody's having a great day. But yeah, connect with your crystals. If you have an amethyst, black, terminal, I feel like somebody could have like a tiger eye. Um, nourish your temple. Some of y'all need to eat healthy. Um, er, and then you also need to create art. Like, you know, lately I've been having like good dates where I've been going to like, um, I forgot that place called, um, taco spots and stuff and um some of y'all need to listen to y'all intuition it's telling you something it really is somebody's creating art and like they need to sell their art you know, I've been seeing this new thing where it's like this person makes sketches and people could paint them. So somebody could be buying like sketch art at on TikTok shop. Make sure you tap the screen. Make sure you share the live. Um, I don't know if anybody's up, but I'm about to see if anybody's up this late. Let's see if anybody's up this late. Let's see what's going on in the angel number 333. Some of y'all been seeing like threes of the threes. Let's see. Some of y'all feel like y'all frustrated and some of y'all keep playing small. The two of wands is somebody who keep playing small, who keep doubting they self. Like you've been seeing three, three, three and like three, 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 three a lot. Some of y'all could be dissatisfied because you're not where you at in life. Like you're, you don't have the car you want. You don't have the apartment that you want. And it's like you're running in circles, but you got to stop. Like, it's like, as soon as you get confident, you want to just knock it down a pedestal. Like you can't just be confident and then dim your light or play small just because somebody don't want you to be confident or somebody don't want you, um, have the po positive affirmations. You got to understand you deserve good things. 
some of y'all are very wise where y'all can see that this queen of pentacles you could have a mom you could have somebody that's very miserable if they don't have money somebody who's very um deceitful i feel like i'm at the point in my life that that everybody's miserable when they don't have no money if god was to take everything they have right now there'll be people panicking because they are attached to materialistic things but at the, the end of the day we got the two of wands here i'm gonna repeat it one more time stop playing small stop when you get close around a family member or mom play small because somebody hates that you're confident hate that you love yourself you got to understand you cannot be delaying your blessings or blocking your blessings or your manifestation that's a way to slow down your manifestation if you let a negative entity a demon a dark witch somebody who don't even got their shit together who is a gold digger the queen of pentacles is somebody who only dates somebody for money or only come around people for materialistic things and they play like they sweet this is a person that will play like they sweet but they really a sour patch kid they sour sweet Sweet and gone after they get what they want you got to understand a manipulator ain't gonna tell you that they are manipulated they're just gonna tell you that they're trying to get something out of you, you feel me with the ten of wands it's like somebody could be also um burdened and i feel like your burdens are gonna be um lightening up a lot of y'all could be hermit where y'all like to go home like right after work a lot of y'all like stay to yourself a lot of y'all are really anti-social with the three of pentacles you're doing a good job even if you're not making a lot of money the fact that you got a job the fact that you chose to go do uber you chose to go start that yard sale that content whatever you do somebody wants to be a model and influencer posting on tiktok you got this with the hierophant, a lot of y'all prayers have been answered. You feel me? I'm learning myself is that to stay as confident and high vibing as you can because there's some people that could try to knock you down. You got to pay attention to people that's like the page of wands. They they look good, but they have narcissistic tendencies. Like you can see that people got this way of charming. It's almost like from Tangle, here comes the smolder. And Rapunzel was looking at him because she never encountered a boy. She's always been in the house. So she's looking at him like, what is this supposed to do to me? Like, this charm, magic, this good looking. Like, y'all cannot be ashamed anymore that you're in 2024. Some of y'all are realizing like, damn, we was just in 2020. That you want to be with somebody that's financially stable. You want to be where your nervous system is calm. You want to have more for yourself. You want to fix your credit. I also have a credit plug. If you cash at me 20, his name is Thomas. He fixed your credit for 500. I had two non-subscribers and two of my subscribers purchase. Okay, this is my page. I am the one. I'm here to help you get to your highest path for your highest good. And no weapon shall prosper spiritually, mentally, financially, or physically to my collective. Let's get into these messages. If you've been seeing 333, to sum it up, you got to stop playing small and you got to stop acting like you're not worthy of the things that you be asking from the universe. If you say you're going to get $10,000, trust and believe that the universe is working a way to give you $10,000. The universe got all the energy and the mon money. It's not like it's impossible. Some of y'all have this mindset where it's like impossible for this to happen. It's impossible. Like, stop. That's enough. Like that TikTok sound like that's enough. Like you could be hating when your baby daddy talking about bad shit about your other baby mama, uh, uh, of his other baby mama. And then you just putting two and two together like he probably doing this with you. You feel me? Somebody is burnt out. It's a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius that don't get the best sleep. For me, I need to make sure y'all getting some good sleep. Let's get the likes up to a thousand. It should be at 50,000 like last night. Well, last live I was on here was 64,000 likes. And then I was on here earlier. It was like 14,000. So let's get these likes up so we get more people in here. Yeah, a lot of y'all walking away from a per, uh, person. I feel like with this six of swords, it's like you see somebody being nice. And it's like, yeah, they spoil you. They take you on a date. But then it's like they do something where it's like, is this person doing it just to do it? Or what's this person motive? Like somebody don't trust a Gemini, a Libra, Aquarius. Like there's somebody that 
made you feel bad about the money it's like you overthinking about whatever this person did to you like It's like this person fixed your car, right? Let's say you're dating a mechanic. This person fixed your car. But then the next day, y'all go hang out. This person gets you so mad to the point you want to break up with them. And this person make it seem like you need them financially. And then you realize that you don't want to be around this person because they think like that. And you you the one that's helping them. Like, okay, let's say you with somebody and they don't have a car. But you have a car. Somebody trying to make it seem like... They the prize and they need your car. Um, they like you get what I'm trying to say. It's almost like when a woman got her own apartment and this man trying to make it seem like he big and mighty, but he's sleeping with you. He's sleeping at your crib. Like, I don't know. It's like giving somebody that's airheaded. Like you keep giving them a chance and a chance, and I feel like you're gonna give up on this person. Somebody could also be super insecure where it's like as soon as they mistreat you, they feel like you're going to go back to your past person or you're going to um, leave them for somebody else better. They could even have people telling them like, oh, you know, Cancer, Gemini, Aries, uh, what's, we got Virgo out here. She's going to leave you for a rich person. You don't even treat her that good. And I feel like you love this person even with they shit not together. I feel like you're not even judging them of they, um finances with the wheel of fortune i feel like they keep focusing on a failure or they keep focusing on what they don't have this person could let people get to them with the wheel of fortune this could be a leo gemini aquarius taurus a lot of y'all been seeing frogs you have a leap of faith the universe wants you to take a leap of faith and adaptability they also want you to know like people can be testing your boundaries, these entities, and you need to be careful of these entities and these people trying to test your boundaries. So I'm going to say this as a recap for people who are just joining. 333, you need to stop playing small. You need to stop acting like we live in a universe, that the universe is the eye. The, the world, if you look at the globe and how the world is, it looked like a human eye. As above, so below. You, what you want, you can have manifest. You wanted that job, right? When you went to that interview, you had that mindset that you're going to get that job. You literally put out an affirmation. Put the energy out that you want to receive and you will receive it. You feel me? I may not be able to change a million people, but baby, I could change at least a 100,000. That's the goal. If I could change 100,000 people to be positive and keep a mindset, keep them stressed. Oh, you know, Ayanna told me maca root helps with anxiety and depression. Ayanna told me going to the beach, seeing some, seeing the ocean or staying near the beach helps me with my depression and anxiety. Or, you know, setting more boundaries, being around good people. Because the nine of wands is somebody who's trying to test your boundaries. You have people that are trying to do a reactive of of emotional abuse meaning they did something to you where it's like they being in and out to you they treat you bad and then they they trying to have a reaction like what's she gonna do i'm testing to see if she gonna leave i'm testing her if i'm gonna if she gonna let me play with her or is this a guy like you know your homeboy like i'm testing to see if he gonna let me slide that guy his car fucked up because he got a hellcat but don't he don't even know i'm jealous of him and i fucked it up on purpose i'm testing him to see if he gonna let me slide because i almost try to holler at his girl but you know homie over homies homie before hoes like somebody's trying to test it you need to be careful not everybody's your friend some of y'all can even get told that Somebody could be trying to drive fast and they almost taking a light in the car with you just to stress you out or cause anxiety. And you got to tell them to stop. I don't think y'all understand. I think somebody around you with that, um, there's like a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, or Aries, Leo, Sag that's not mentally well. Okay? And you got to be careful of the people that you hanging around. This is even crazy where there was a time where... I had people where it was like, um, I had people where, let's say it was an um, old crush and they was watching me on TikTok. And you know, my old friend who, who do terror too, she was like, oh, I don't like when you got people that, you know, 
is watching your live and getting downloads. So there's some weirdos that will act like the person you're talking about. Let's say they're uh, Aquarius and they hear you saying that it's Aquarius being toxic. Guess what? When you see them the next day, they're going to try to be toxic. They're going to try to be like, oh yeah, I'm going to give cancer hell. I'm going to give Aries hell today. Shit, I'm going to give Mon um, Monique hell. Ashley hell. Somebody, anybody who's causing you confusion, they also giving you inner clarity of what you want and what you don't want. Because at the end of the day, you deserve the world. You feel me? You deserve the world. And somebody knows that. Somebody knows that you are more than what they asked for. You're more than amazing. They never had someone did something just because it could have been like you did this with an ex or a person you was currently dealing with. Like, you know, gave them a ride. Let them use they let them use your car. Um and, you know, I always tell people don't do that. But we all been there one time where we let somebody use their car. And if you have it, you have it. But it's like something that you did that no, like, I feel like y'all come across people where they never had the type of love that you gave out with their exes, exes, exes. You got to look at that like, don't you think they're a karmic? All they exes, all they did was fuck around and found out. All they did was have sex. And you the only one that's trying to tell this person about taking care of their mental health, eating vitamins, um, trying to help them with their groceries. You got to understand, things come with limitations, okay? Make sure y'all tap on the screen and sharing the live. You can't be like, you are so kind. And I think it's because you've been traumatized by your mom and your dad to the point where it's like they taught you that you have to do something in order to get love. And the fact that you see it, you see the problem and you're trying to fix it. It's not going to happen overnight or it's not going to change overnight. But the fact that you, it's like somebody seeing that they have a shopping problem. Baby, what are we going to do to help you with this shopping problem? You already start giving your sister or your cousin or your bro the money so you can start saving money. You got to stay away from people too. Somebody can have a mom where you save money, more money than her. And this person try to make it seem like you can't save money. But then they the same one that was drying out your bank account, asking you for $100 here, $1,000 here. And then once you don't have no money, they want to be like, oh, you can't save. That person don't fucking like you. I'm going I'm to be blunt. Because this reading going to be short and sweet. Any tips, donations, bookings, please book now. Because in the next 10 minutes, I'm going to bed. Okay? Okay? Unless this reading get even more juicier, I'm going to stay on here. But I'm telling you right now. Somebody needs to connect to their crystals with the self-care card. And then you also got nourish your temple. Somebody also need a chant. Because the thing is about this, if you, I'm going to put this um, reading on live where it's like, don't let people make you play small. With the two of wands, don't let these people make you play small, delay you. You blocking your own blessings. Like my boyfriend said, these entities, all they could do is plant a negative seed in your mind. If they can make you believe that you ain't shit, if they can make you believe that shit ain't going to work out, baby, they won. Now you guys sit there and meditate or pray that negative energy off of you because now you sitting here thinking that you ain't that girl or that guy. Baby, get that person away from you. Some of y'all need to move out these people's houses. You know, even somebody was trying to say you could be scared to live on your own. You got people that hates on you so bad. They, they pushing that you struggle living on your own, paying your own bills. Like what's next? This person hopes that you stay emotionally imbalanced, don't take care of your mental health. The temperance in reverse is somebody who don't take care of their mental health. They, they smoke too much, they drink too much, they have too much SEX. Somebody want to look at you like you don't take life serious and you got their shit to most together. The most you probably missing collective is some money. That's the most y'all missing is some more money. That's all y'all missing collective. Somebody needs $10,000 today, $30,000 today, and y'all need to figure out how you're going to get it. We got six months left. Somebody's trying to figure out to work smarter, not harder. We got to stop saying that it's not going to happen because you got an attentive partner that's here that wants to protect you. <coughs> Damn, I need some juice. That's one thing I do hate. I left everything at my boyfriend's house. God damn. I don't even keep my groceries here anymore. Yeah, y'all getting a bountiful amount of money. Okay, a lot of y'all gonna be shocked when y'all get this money. I'm hearing like 
the fuck? I'm hearing 10,000. I'm hearing like, I've been seeing that a lot. Like, somebody's gonna win $10,000, $30,000. I've been saying about the casino lottery. Somebody's gonna have a attentive man that they manifest. And at first, you might be triggered, but y'all both gonna take your time and be in a healthy connection. You feel me? Ain't nobody better than a group. I'm hearing temptation where it's like, you know, you could get on this person where it's like, you don't have to do 50-50 if you dating a man. This man knows that you could have someone paying the whole rent. This man knows that you got to know that you worthy of that. Somebody needs to watch the Baddest You podcast on Spotify. Okay, it really does help you with your confidence. You feel me? You got this new beginning. A lot of y'all thinking before y'all speak and, you know, you got to also be aware of a queen of swords, a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. You got to be careful. I'm even hearing Leo, Sagittarius, Gemini heavies out here. We also got Aries because this is the sign of Libra is Aries. Y'all really got to be careful. Somebody's just trying to cut they, they words. Like, be bitchy. Be hot and cold. Throw your mood off. It's like somebody's a demon, bro. And they know how to be fucking narcissistic. They know how to do all the things to fuck up your mood. With a magician, somebody's manifesting a new home. You've been seeing U-Hauls. You're going to be moving. If you've been wanting to get your passport, you're about to get the money real fast. Somebody needs to do a money spell or light a candle. You need to pay attention and, and um pray. Somebody needs to pray and use Psalm 70 and verse 24. Nothing bad's gonna happen. Cause there is somebody who's fearing change. A Scorpio. What's the sister sign? A Scorpio. I think it's Taurus. There's a Taurus. There's somebody who's stubborn. They stuck in their ways. That's what it's given. The page of swords is somebody who's all talk. Be careful somebody doing that. All that womp, 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 womp. Boy, your time up. Girl, your time up. Somebody just do the talk. They ain't walking. They ain't showing you shit. I'm sorry. It's like y'all y'all energy is giving like you impatient. You got six months left of this damn year. Somebody trying to make it seem like you a gold digger. Let them believe that shit. You want to be financially stable. You've been in a household where you saw people act fucking chaotic over money you could even had a mom that was mean i went on the best taco date with three couples me and my boyfriend somebody else and we was just sitting there even talking about how we was we had our own little disagreement we was sitting here like bro we hate how parents be like oh i did all this for you i took care of you i made sure you was straight ain't you that's your job ain't that what you supposed to do when you get a puppy, when I got a puppy, I knew I had to bait it, feed it, take care of it. I'm not waiting for the government or the, the law enforcement, the enforced law, like, oh, you ain't taking care of your, anim your, your animal or your baby, you going to jail. That is your kid. That is somebody you love, you vow to take care of. I'm confused. Y'all could have even seen y'all mom had a more relationship with love with a man than their own kid. Somebody's boy crazy. That's what it's given. Hey, Evelyn. And somebody's watching you juggle all these jobs. Like, you could have, you know, a job here, a job there. Like, I have a part-time job, and I'm very grateful, but it's only two days out the week. It may not do a lot for me, but it's helping something than nothing. Had a great interview. Feel like I got the job. Still apply for 20 more jobs. You feel me? With a sun card. All is well. Somebody's getting like a, a bountiful of money. Somebody might even call off of their job. Be like, damn, I got so much money, I could quit. You feel me? Leo, you are having a great day. I see the sun. I open my eyes. I see in the sun. Somebody can have a brain like Jumi Neutron where it's like, think think and like you learn to think and solve solutions and figure things out with the six of pentacles there's a lot of things coming out for you in career money and love you got to understand the universe wants to help you when it comes to your business goal you've been wanting to open a workshop you've been wanting to open like a meditating center you know you want to make your podcast bigger i'm feeling like somebody wants to even open a homeless shelter you feel me 
an animal shelter. The Six of Pentacles could be also somebody wants to start an Airbnb, a vending machine. You're going to get the money. It may not be today, but you will get the money. And you got to understand whoever missed a chance with you, they missed a chance with you. Y'all are going to be stable. So this is this is going from who to stay the fuck away from and to money. You are going to be balanced. Even if you're around these toxic people, you got to understand these entities can feel negative energy. These entities can know. Somebody can even be like, okay, let's say you want some money. Damn, why is they not approving a comment? Same. I wanted to do the same thing. Like with the um, Ace of Pentacles, you are coming into stability and the strength. That's why y'all been seeing 11-11. Y'all just been fighting. The most y'all been fighting that's negative. Negative thoughts is lack mindset, lack of confidence. A lot of y'all got to change it with gratitude and being grateful. A lot of y'all going to be moving. The Six of Cups is in reverse. A lot of y'all are moving. I kid you not. You're getting your happy ending. It's not fair. It's like you could have even told somebody like with the Nine of Pentacles. Yeah, I do live beyond my means. Like you letting people believe whatever you want to believe. Thank you for the roses because I kid you not. That's one thing. When I was at this taco date with my boyfriend and his fr his family and his, not his family, but his friends that are his family and other, another couple, even the strangers we was getting along with, we just talking. It's like if people want to believe that you broke or you miserable without money, let them believe that because these same people saw you even when you was down bad. You could have had people that saw you at your lowest, working, doing hair, going to clean this house put in two and two and then when you ask for help this person wanted to be the one person that make it be known that i'm not gonna help you i'm not gonna do shit for you you feel me i'm telling you right now somebody heavily projecting somebody's making it seem like you in the universe is punishing you hey imani for like you know um you buying something off to me or TikTok shop. Baby, that was $80. The the amount of bills that you got, you need $3,000. What is $80 going to do to to a debt that you owe of $200, $500? I understand you could have paid towards it, but you are paying money towards it. Baby, somebody's just trying to have you stressed out, baby. With the reality check, you getting a reality check really quick. Somebody just want to look at you like you materialistic, that you're not happy, and you the most kindest person, the most humblest person. You rejecting this person too. With the Queen of Wands, y'all very confident, have a zest for life. Like one thing I'm doing, I remember saying, if you haven't checked my videos on YouTube, check the link in the bio where I said there's a video on. Um, I said um. What did I say? Shit. Um, have more fun. Go out and have more fun. Where I want to go to the museum. I want to go smoke and be on cloud nine watching dolphins and fish swim. I want to go painting. I want to go do pottery classing. I want to go biking. I want to go see the sunset. It's simple shit. All this work, 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 work. I'm hearing that song. I'm living my best life. I ain't going back and forth with you ninjas. I'm living my best life. You know what I'm saying? Smile, bitch. Smile, bitch. Come on. Like, most of these people know how to make you unhappy. And that's how you know they a fucking hater. Look at how much effort your family do. Or your, 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 thank you for the gift. Or somebody, um... You know, I was even talking about Evelyn in a video where you taught me to stay humble. Like, it don't make no sense letting money get to your head. There was nice Latina people we was around at the taco spot. There was nice couples we was around. And they say money is literally a tool. The thing is, we was all talking about energy. Like, believing in yourself. Understanding good things do deserve to come to you. Like, people just got to understand that. And you got to know it's divine timing. I kid you not. Alex, Ele El Alex, Evelyn, Morgan, CC, Scarlett, master that shit. It's to the point, I know Scarlett's good. She be moving in silent. 
Even when she wanted to move, I said she gonna move. Even when Alex wanted to move, she got her apartment. Ain't nobody stopping shit. It's like, if you a cancer, or if you a sister sign of cancer Capricorn, ain't nobody stopping shit. You too fast. It's like, you gotta be quicker than that. Meet me. You feel me? One time, um, my boyfriend was trying to say, like, I look like the bird from Meet Me. Because, like, when I go running, he'd be like, damn, you run fast as fuck. I'm out of shape as hell. Like, yeah, like, I'm not waiting on your ass. Catch up. Like, when I get on my mode to work out, I be on my mode. Like, it's like a beast come out. People like to say demons. I don't, I don't say that word. I just be like, err. I be like, pop smoke. Like, err, I, I got to get into my mode. Like, put the headphones on. Get the music in. Like, let's go. Like, like you remember that person that broke your heart? Man, I be... The, remember that person that left you down? I be pushing myself. Like, my body almost there. The abs are almost there. The butt is getting bigger too, okay? A lot of y'all could be into Egyptian. Somebody could want a tattoo of the Egyptian eye that protects you or bring good luck. There's one eye that brings, I think it's the white, the right one that brings like good luck. But the left one, a lot of people get the left one for protection. Because baby, there's people out here that's je jealous. And there's like a, a queen of wands, a Jezebel spirit that do not like you. I don't know who this queen of wands is. I don't even know who this Capricorn Taurus Virgo is. But my right ear is ringing. And thank you for the gift. And I'm not saying thank you enough. Because I kid you not. There's somebody who lacks confidence. That's shy, catty, overbearing. It could be your mama. It could be somebody who act like a mama. It could be like somebody who act like this in your work job. Whoever this person is. I need you to learn that they only want your energy. Like I, I was watching Baddest Podcast. And she was saying like. Um. Aubrey was saying like bro protecting your energy where it's like people just want to get a reaction out of you They just want to make you feel like you're less than you got to understand that you are the star and that you're not gonna speak highly of yourself Yes, you live in a toxic environment, but you know that hey, I know what it is and I'm gonna get myself out of this I know I'm gonna work my ass off and get out of this. I know that things are working out in my favor I'm not gonna have a loser mentality. I kid you not. She knows what she's doing of uplifting people and it was times where she was not at her best self but i seen her still grow i still sh i see her fought her own people like to say demons fight her own negative thoughts demons whatever y'all want to call it negative self-talk and be like you know what i'm gonna pull dude because i have a whole collective i have a whole audience watch me and i need to be that girl i am a baddie hello i of course everything works out for me like y'all gotta understand somebody's a devil around you Okay, because I just the next card that pulled out the queen of wands and the devil is giving like this somebody in a human form that really feel like you ain't gonna never like them. I feel like you finally learned to forgive somebody for your own sake and peace. But the thing is, you don't trust that this person put this much effort into fucking up your day instead of like, oh, wow, I never seen that before. Thank you. It's like, like, I don't know, somebody don't have a person that they trust like. It's crazy how it's like you could have somebody, I don't know, this is why I don't listen to people, okay? This is why I don't pay, because there was a girl who was doing makeup and then, you know, it was going viral on Root Magic where somebody was so jealous of envy of her work, she ended up just quitting just to work a job that's going to live check to check. And you got to understand, if people want to believe that you toxic or you narcissistic, you got to let them believe that, boo. Because there's too many... It's giving an entity. That devil card is giving an entity. There's somebody trying to find you. A baby daddy, a baby mama, an ex. And I'm talking about somebody you was talking in February, May, June. Somebody got their ex blocked. Some of y'all don't. And if the ones you got blocked, great. I'm not talking to you. You're good. The ones who resonate, it can even be a friend. Some of y'all, I, I kid you not, with my right hand itching, I really feel like it's a family member. It's really a family member that don't fucking like you, that sleep around for money. They don't have to do that, but they do that anyways. They don't They don't want to get a job. They rather date a boyfriend and have them take, be taken care of. And I'm not saying that's a bad thing. Everybody deserves it. But this person is a type of person. They'll get what they want and still be mad at you. Still be hating on you. Oh, you know, she got to work a job. Ayanna, she, she doing it the right way. She like, who the fuck is, what's wrong with this person? That's the best thing. I was going to say Morgan. I was like, bro, like, what's wrong with this person? Like, you see somebody that don't have to trick themselves 
and you mad baby if you understand how many demons are out here and sexual transmitted i i if some people look at my std card where it's like or my karma cards where it says like it, i i look at it like a sexual transmitted demon there's some people that will really swap energy with you where they send negative energy to you and they get all your good your good energy okay there's people that's disguised as good people and baby if you if the mask fall down they really a devil if the mask was taken off they really behind closed door is a devil my hand's scratching thank you you feel me and at least you tell somebody like you know you could even have a problem where people just don't like you telling the truth like baby i tell the truth about my damn self like ayana you know you slipping ayana you know you getting in your feelings you need to be applying for more jobs ayana you know you only missing some more money you need to get your place you need to get this done correctly because you got haters you get you getting pushed out this is my last year staying here if i don't get my shit together ain't no i ain't gonna have no place Thank everybody knows everybody in this place is moving out so it's like yeah you feel me i was even thinking of ideas of gofundme whatever i can do because at the end of the day it's all gonna work out for us but there is somebody i literally told y'all if y'all my subscribers thank you for the gift if you are my subscribers i did tell y'all to get a double reversal because it's supposed to be black at the top and red at the bottom or black at the top if you've been feeling like your money been getting t attacked and green at the bottom this also a blockbuster it literally says get you anointing oil cleanse it with some florida water and it has that little white little area what you want the candle to do return a center to anybody who um is doing it well and then you post to read psalms 24 and then you post to meditate and pray and and do it like each day for an hour most people don't because time be busy and hectic with kids and bills and stuff like that but you're doing a good job then you got somebody from your past that's obsessed with you it's like a cancer pisces scorpio it's giving like fan crazy like fan behavior this is like a person that would like to go through everything you went through so they could receive the same blessings that you do like i got a day a toxic person like evelyn so i can get blessed i gotta learn to be humble and be in my divine feminine like evelyn and then like that's not how it works baby you gotta be yourself i don't know who this person is they gotta be they self and they lack self-love like how you gonna be somebody and you don't really did this you didn't even do the shadow work everybody in here that's the 29 30 people 40 people you did the shadow work whether you got the tiktok shadow work most good shadow work questions i found was on pinterest you did the shadow work you actually love yourself you actually um child this person also emotionally manipulate this is a person that could be 24 to 36 or older it's like somebody has a mindset of an 18 year old like they keep doing shit where it's like it keep pissing you off for me it could be yeah it's somebody who's the moon card this is a person that cheats in a relationship this is a person i think they player oh man So I remember when somebody was explaining the moon card, they was like, this is somebody who cheats, they deceptive, they hide things, things are not being exposed, there's things being done in the dark during a full moon or during a new moon, somebody could be doing magic, it's like somebody who's cheating in a marriage. exactly it takes a lot of patience too people don't understand the therapy you had to go through the the fact that your therapy was telling you your therapist was telling you the truth about your behaviors or you know um saving money even when you want to go get your hair done get your nails done people think that shit's easy being humble that shit ain't easy or um being kind like i remember sister sister t and tamara she was like bro people think it's so easy being kind baby it's so quick to snap but then you got to realize that's what the devil wants you to do. The devil wants you to worry. The devil wants you to snap. The devil wants you to read. Like, why are we snapping on somebody when they bite the hand that fed them? Baby, you help this person. They the reason why they eating. They the reason why, you know, 
even my boyfriend, he figured it out today. Like, he like, damn, my right ear is itching. Like, it's ringing like a mofo. I was like, bro, money is literally like a tool. It's just like, if people want to believe that, oh, it eases the stress, hey, you got to let them believe that. You feel me? Damn, my ear is itching. Like, because I'm tired. It's almost like him and his friends were saying, like, you know, when you start getting fame from your family, it's like people me making rumors up, and then you be like, baby, that's not even true. And you like, I don't even got the energy to explain to you how that's a fucking lie. If that's what you want to believe, somebody's like seeing that you unbothered and it's driving people crazy. Like, why don't why do you want to play with me? I'm bored. Play with me. It's like that TikTok sound. Play with me, I'm bored. Like, baby, I can't play with you. I got these bills that want my money. On top of that, I want to travel. I want to be in Jamaica in a coconut in Bahama. I'm trying to figure out how I'm going to get my passport by tomorrow and my money straight by tomorrow. And you want me to worry about you? You're not going to even pay for a flight. You're not going to even pay for a trip just because. Some of y'all are the ones that create good events. Like, okay, let's do a s'mores. Let's go out to eat. Let's brunch on me. Let's go to the movies together. Let's do, like, you the one that's always... What's that? Initiating stuff? Baby, uh-uh. And I'm sorry I'm up late. It was just a nice taco spot I was at. It was really fun. Then we went to the beach. And then it started to rain. And then all five of us is just trying to run to the fucking car. Like, I wanted to get ice cream too, but fuck that. Maybe another day. Hey, Scarla. I was just speaking highly of you. Yeah, with the Ace of Pentacles, like, somebody is fucking mad that you're going to be straight. Somebody could even see, like, somebody could even think it's a man. Like, hold on. Yo, this is the hardest my ear ever ringed in my fucking life. What the fuck? One minute is sunny and the next minute is rain. I'm like, what the hell? It was calm. The moon, the moon looks so nice. Like, it, it, oh, blah, blah, blah. What today is? It's still the full moon. So a lot of y'all, y'all gotta just say I'm prospering. I'm prosper. I'm prospering. I'm letting go of negative energy. Because the, the full moon and strawberry is so good. It feels really good. Like, it just feels like new beginnings. If, if y'all been seeing 420, it's like, I know y'all think that's y'all smoke day. Like, you know, puff, puff, pass. But it also means, listen to your intuition that your breakthrough is coming very soon. The emperor. You know, I feel like somebody is playing dumb around you and they not dumb. But I feel like they doing it because they got negative entities around them. With the Eight of Swords. I feel like you're standing on business too. Anybody who had made you have negative self-talk or negative thoughts, you're not keeping them around. Somebody's lazy or having no groundwork, I need you to go get you some root soap or um, Florida water. I mean, Florida water soap and that's like at the beauty supply store for a dollar 25 it's like like when you go to the beauty supply store one thing i learned about these botanic stores they will sell florida water for 12 dollars at their store which they are allowed but at the beauty supply store they selling it for five dollars eight dollars the biggest bottle you can get for 10 and they selling that little bottle at the store at the botanic for like eight dollars twelve dollars I'm teaching you something. You could even order it on Amazon. You know Amazon take the next day to get their payment. Get you the get you the soap. Get you the Rose of Jericho. And you know, um, what's another spiritual thing that people need to have in their house too? Get you some root sage. Keep that hanging. Somebody needs to get you a rosemary plant and an aloe plant and a basil plant. Those are the three plants. If you read the Green Witch book, which Green Witch book was really about her peroxide locking mirrors and keeping a cinnamon broom in your house. It was basically keeping shit in your house that keep your house balanced. Also, when you moved in, it was taught. It was teaching me something about white candles, like. You know, before you move all your stuff in your house, light a white candle at the each of the window, let it burn to the nips. You know, 
You feel me? Some of y'all gonna date somebody that's spiritual like you. Like, they want to protect themselves from negative energy. They don't want to bring the generational curse. Because why, why do that? You don't even want a spouse that get jealous of your kids because they got a luxury life. You may not have that life, but you know one thing I learned from the older folks? You giving your kids the good life that you should have, you're going to get so much blessings in the afterlife. And that's what makes me so blessed. Like, okay, I wanted this protection that I wish I had when I was a kid. But I make sure my God kids are safe around me or my, my kids that I be babysitting. And they be like, they can see the energy. They can feel the energy. Like, every time I'm with Ayana, I'm going to feel safe. I'm going to get what I want and I'm going to be protected. Like, God bless you. I don't know if I'm explaining it the best way, but that's the best way I can explain. When you do good to others, you don't expect nothing in return, you get protected. You feel me? Yeah, it sucks. It's almost like Kung Fu Panda. One thing that turtle that turtle said, or whatever he said, he was like, "Yeah, it sucks." Or was it um Lion King that monkey? Yeah, it sucks. It hurt a little while, but you can't stay there because it's like, yeah, I had to learn to get through that. Like, yeah, it does suck, but if I keep focusing on how bad it sucks, it's gonna make me sad. It ain't gonna make it better. And all I can do is be like, you know what? How about God is going to bless you with that house, that apartment, that prosperity, the mindset to help other people. And then on top of that, your kids don't have to worry about that. And your kids, kids don't got to go through that. Because somebody finally, because your mom did this, your mom, mom did this to her. And then your mom decided to do it to you. And it stops with you. Or if you continue it, it's going to lead to your daughter who's going to have to stop it for her next daughter. It's a generational curse. I don't know how to break it down. That's why I made that video, the end of generational curse. I'm surprised that's not at a million views yet. Because I was literally saying how these parents be so toxic and they make it narcissistic parent, narcissistic kids. And they be like, oh, where they picked it up from you. Where they get that attitude from you. Where they get that, oh, they can't save and always spend it from you. You stress shop around your kids. You do more shopping than saving. You do more talking shit than helping out others. You do more praying on somebody's downfall than believing that they could do better and do good. You pick and choose which sibling or which kid that you like the most and make the other one feel bad. Baby, you act like God ain't seeing you or the universe ain't seeing your bad behavior. That's another thing that these demons and the entities be getting on my damn nerve. How the fuck you gonna do all this fuck shit? These exes and then you be shocked. You be shocked when karma get your ass. That's why I let people believe whatever the fuck you wanna believe. Because when karma get your ass, baby, don't think it was me lighting a fucking candle. Because baby, I don't do none of that shit. My candle workings is for anybody who's sitting in the EY. Whatever you ask for me is going back to you. But I don't really got to do that. I just show the collective what you got to do because I already did my protection spells. I got a lady that I paid for money spells and I ain't never being broke again. So I'm, I did everything. It was even to the point where there was another girl where she said her yearly money spells was $350. i am tired. A lady found a way and I'm getting my way out because I was like, yo, what do I got to do? You know, you did it the right way, working a job, doing it for two years. You see some growth. You save some money. Now you're seeing people trying to, what can you do differently? I'm always trying to do something differently, okay? Even when y'all get this money for people who play money on a scratch-off casino or, you know, you getting approved for that grant, that loan, getting that vending machine. Baby, ain't nobody going to know. And the ones that's going to be dissatisfied and they, um, materialistic, they're going to be like, oh, you know, Evelyn, Sarah, Ashley's being different. She acting like she better than us. Actually, when she was down bad and she was crying, nobody was there for her. And she had to learn to pull herself through and God was there. It's like, I'm hearing DJ Cali, like, no one believed us, but God did. My spirit guide did. The hermit also represents the spirit guide. You got wise old folks that you are very powerful. I'm hearing that song by Cash Doll. Never let a man disrespect you more than once. Two, always keep some money to the side. Three, always making sure you getting your cheese. Four, always making sure you keep yourself on tip top. I don't know. I don't know the commandment, but keep it on tip top shape. Okay? There ain't no hex or um blockages happening. And if you feel in despair or feeling like you out of faith, baby, you need to pray. 
I hate saying it like this because when my friend broke down that song, I was like, I like how that song goes. Did you pray today? Did you pray? But then he told me they making fun of God. And that's why I stopped listening to music and hip hop. I listen to only high vibe music like this all day, even when I fall asleep, because it's like Some of y'all don't have the best prayer routine. You got to keep praying. Because when you pray, you see that somebody prays literally asking God, I need to make $20. I need to find $20. God answer your prayer. Then three days later, you forgot about God. Baby, you got to pray about protection. You got to pray for God to bring residual. And you got to pray that God makes ends meet and stop making you live check by check. Someone needs to be specific. Like, God, I'm tired of living check to check or struggling or um dealing with the bare minimum or going through life struggles or being around people that think like when I'm telling them my life story that I'm hearing they problems, what they went through and thinking that no one cares. Because there's a query that's despair, fate, fateless. Somebody don't have no damn faith, don't believe in good things that's going to happen to them. And I, I, feel, I kid you not, when I feel like when I'm around people that feel like they in despair or nothing good's going to happen, it's because they're karmic. That's what I'm learning. Like, that video, Stop Explaining Yourself to Demons, helped me a lot. Okay? Helped me a lot. Thank you for the gift. Oh, dang. That was, that was loud. We had 50%. I heard that sound. I'm like, I got scared. Thank you for following me. Make sure y'all follow me on YouTube. Thank you for the gift, Scarla. Join the team, too. With the Knight of Swords, it's giving like you got fast thinking. You're very ambitious and you're making proper planning so you don't have piss, perform, piss poor performance. It's like you win the lottery, right? Let's say you have a dream to win 30000 Let's say the lottery is 30000 3 million. You already know, first I'm going to get me a property. First I'm going to pay my debts. First I'm going to give thanks to God or after you give thanks to God, you're going to pay your debts. You're going to pay your bills. You're going to get you land. You're going to make sure you straight. Because some of y'all got to have it where I want to send money here. I want to cash app somebody here. Make sure you get your property. Those people going to get their money. The ones that looked out for you. You know, that auntie, that friend that was there when you was at your lowest and nobody knew. And you was silent and they found you. Those people are going to find. They going to get they whatever. You could have want to buy them a car. Baby, but first, whatever the universe is giving you. You already had signs. Some of y'all been seeing 10, 10, and 11, 11. Y'all on the right path. If you've been seeing rabbits, baby, I've been seeing rabbits. And I love seeing rabbits. That's fast luck. That's abundance. That means it's a huge shift. The last time I seen a rabbit is when I had got 3,000. And it was because I got in an accident. And it was not a car accident. It was like a slip and fall at a restaurant. Literally. That was, and that was like a year ago. Two years ago. I feel like a year and a half. And I've been seeing rabbits like crazy. And it also means fertility. It also means somebody's having a baby around you. Or you going to be having a baby soon. Then you least expect it. Thank you, Evelyn, for sending me the hand heart. I really do appreciate that. You got to be careful of these emotional manipulators. They, they just have a fear of you getting outside the box. It's like somebody put you in a box. Somebody put you in this box where they think you okay with one-sided relationship. This is why I don't trust people that once they take advantage of your kindness, they want to fit, they want to, they want to sit there and they want to fucking believe that. That you okay with this bullshit, this kiss ass shit, this one sided shit like, oh, they pick and choose after they piss you off. Okay, let's go tacos. Let's go to the beach. Let's go do everything that Cancer love to do. Pisces love to do. Gemini like to do. Like, boo, baby, if you catch on somebody fakeness, let them go. Because the person you're supposed to be with, with the lovers, I said this in the last live when we was at 64,000 likes. I kid you not, the lovers. And the king of pentacles, you're supposed to be with a provider man. Whether that's some of y'all, it's not even 50-50. The man I not gonna even let you pay for the rent. Okay? I kid you not. Even when I told my friend about the 64,000 likes, some of y'all have friends that celebrate your small wins. 
Like, if I was around Morgan, she got 200 subscribers or 10 subscribers. We're going to get a cupcake. We're going to put a little candle on there. And we're going to be like, we got 10 subscribers. It's better than nothing. You feel me? Because I can only imagine how God tests, um, you know, um, Tyler, the creator, his homeboy will post content and he was not getting no views and no like it was good content. Can you imagine that? And we take the little things for granted that we got five views, 10 likes. Like, be grateful. There is somebody who is probably even more talented because you. I already put this in my mind. People... There's more people that's more beautiful. There's more people out here that's more smarter, but they're not me. Everybody's different where they don't got the same heart as you. They don't got the same mindset as you. You know, I can say from my lifetime that I helped a lot of people. I made sure people was good and I lived a good life. And I can also say I learned Spanish. You know, the only thing is, is when I start smoking and I was around people that didn't speak Spanish and kept focusing on... kept focusing on other people bullshit i lost like that's why they said you know practice what you preach and if you don't rem if you don't um like learn keep if you don't keep practicing swimming or keep practicing your makeup even though there was a time where i stopped doing makeup for a whole year i almost forgot how to slay my own face because there was a point i had a pattern how to do it so it's like how, what that saying go is like if you don't keep up what you do or maintain what you have you gonna lose it you gonna lose your touch you feel me i even got these headphones that i'm supposed to be relearning spanish i'm not playing i'm not playing i already got my body yeah your man gonna be very fine the king of wands is also somebody if y'all want to know they also good in the bedroom but they very handsome they take care they um they hygiene they a natural leader they optimistic they see you feeling bad about yourself they like baby you know you're beautiful you know you're you're enough you know that you're capable like this person gives you affirmation this person's not trying to impress anybody this person is going to have this mindset it's you and me against the world because when it was you and your family members or um you know, you're going to have that. Yeah, with the Ten of Pentacles. Scarlett, you got, you're going to have that. You're going to have somebody very wealthy with the Two of Cups. Y'all going to have somebody that's wealthy and y'all got to believe in it. The thing is, one thing, I think the most craziest thing my boyfriend said on his spiritual walk when we was all on a couple date, mind you, he said the thing is that people don't believe and he walked everybody around he's like you know what you right like why do you why do you have this belief belief is also a sense of doubt and he was like you just gotta know like it's already yours like he mastered that shit in three days how to have a calm spirit where it's like you know and he he has the the capability of anger issues and spasm but he's like i'm not giving to these demons anymore i'm not and we all of the rest of us is like, damn, you know, I still want to curse somebody out. I still want to tussle. It could be even like, you know, you you're struggling with confidence. You're struggling with um, self doubt or negative talk. You getting there? You getting there? Oh, I'm not trying to learn only the the curse words, but there's a site that I have. I'm gonna literally play it while I sleep. And it can also help me when I do have people want to book a reading and they only speak Spanish. And you know what's crazy? I would never forget this girl because she was so focused on, she saw my sister, but she was asking about me. She was like, oh, they was talking about you because she she came from she came from DR and I did her financial aid and I made sure she went to get registered at the school. And then when her sister needed a job, me and her and her sister walked to this job. And, you know, I knew Spanish people speak Spanish and it was going to help each other because in the Latina culture, y'all help one another. And every time I go to that Bravo, bro, they always look out for me. They always be kind to me. And I just always tell people don't make fun of people because maybe they may not know English, whether they're Spanish. I even dealt with people that was Russian, Creole. I even worked that financial aid. I worked. I seen everything. 
I seen people who didn't even want to do the work and want their financial aid and they'd be like, thank you. Like, I can't look at them like, oh, they greedy. Oh, that's all they want is they find. They still got to have to put in the work to learn that education. Okay. Yeah, they might be getting money in that refund, but they still got to learn to read that book. They got to go to class. They got to understand registering for their class. There's a lot of things that's getting to and a lot of y'all got to be patient. I'm going to end it off right there. With the Seven of Pentacles, a lot of y'all got to be patient. And I'm going to read y'all comments too. We could do help each other. Okay, I got you. We could help each other. The Seven of Pentacles, you got to be patient. The universe did not forget about you. The Seven of Pentacles is the sum it up. The Seven of Pentacles, the universe did not forget about you. They see all your hard work. You got to trust in divine timing. Okay, that impatient, that wanting it now, it's my money, I want it now. It's just making you look a little ungrateful, but it's also stressing yourself out. You got to understand they're going to come. You feel me? Even listen to some of the 18 year or 19 year olds. They be telling me the moment you don't give a damn about the what's going on in the universe. Who that? The moment you don't give a fuck what's going on in the universe. What is this? about like negativity you get exactly what you want like i'm not stressing about money and the universe knows that you love your money like you oh i'm gonna give you five dollars then it wants you to see if you're gonna get stressed out you got this little five you still not give oh, i'm gonna give you ten thousand it feel me it's like i don't know it's a weird sick game with the universe it's like the more you less care and you know that you're gonna get everything you want the, sh the shit start working out for you and for some of y'all it's just the more you pray the more you see things working out for you and another way for some of y'all it's like three ways for some people like because i i go through like out of two of the three and i think the last one It's like you got to say what you want and understand it's going to manifest into the reality. A lot of y'all got to get better sleep schedules. So I got to get up and be at work tomorrow. So no more self-doubt. No more lack of confidence. If you're a Leo, if you're a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, it ain't getting you nowhere but stress, baby. A lot of y'all ending conflicts. A lot of y'all avoiding conflict. A lot of y'all just agreeing and disagree with people. Sorry. I keep telling you, uh, tart cherry juice. And someone needs to get a humidifier and add some lavender. You could even go to the dollar store. Literally, Scarlett, someone literally told me, and they wasn't even a subscriber. She literally said it worked. Get some Florida water. And she put it in her lavender bottle from the Dollar Tree, sprayed it around her bed. She slept like a baby. I kid, I kid you not. A lot of y'all could have like a disharmony with a or falling out with a friend, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. I feel like you're not taking it no personal because the higher thing, God meant that meant that to happen. So if you've been falling out with friends, it's because the shit they were saying behind your back. If you only seen, you'll be like, you probably won't even trust people anymore. Okay. And sister signs of um. The water signs is basically the earth sign because if you're a Pisces, your sister sign is Virgo. And if you're a Cap, I mean, if you're a Cancer, sister sign is Capricorn. If you're a Scorpio, it's Taurus. So basically, your sister sign is earth sign. So water and earth sign, y'all shouldn't even be worrying about money. Y'all just trying to make it out. Yeah, somebody needs to not pay a, a Virgo that's in reverse. No mind. Because all they're going to do is delay you. A Aries Leo Sag. Last card. Yeah, because somebody's playing this victim mentality game. And you know it. And you're doing a good job. I'm hearing the universe telling you you're doing a good job. That's why you've been seeing the Three of Pentacles. Positivity. Opti uh, optimi uh, very optimistic mind. And then you also have like... Yo, yo, you, the universe, when you see 333 or 3333... They're supporting you in every aspect in your life. Love, support, money, career. Like you can have whatever you want. I'm hearing you can have whatever you like by T.I. The justice card. For all that shit when people count you out. For all the time when people made you feel like you was not enough. You are getting justice for it. 
Some of y'all could be getting a tattoo of your zodiac sign or a tattoo in general. And it's somebody that's a king of swords, a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, that's probably 30 or up or they older than you, that's getting karma. And you're very disciplined. You're very intelligent. Like someone knows that you're intelligent. Someone loves your mindset. You staying prayed up. I feel like that's the most sweetest thing to pray for somebody. Like I like to pray for my collective. You got the four swords, the sun, and the king of cups with the magician. You're manifesting a divine love. All we missing is the higher fin, but we have the higher fin right here. You getting a divine love. It ain't no, they ain't no, you know, even with my readings with the healthy relationships, next is going to be your money. There's always going to be another problem. Next is going to be trying to get away from toxic people because sometimes when you get away from toxic people, they get so mad at you, they still want to be around you. Like, oh, when you coming back to the family and union, I haven't seen you at the last barbecue. The last barbecue I was at, I almost beat that auntie ass for lying on my name. So let's just keep it a buck and let's keep it a P. Or, you know, most of your family is miserable and y'all just only going to miss me because I got money, pretty much. You feel me? That's it. And sometimes it's just like when you focus on you, it's almost like that guy who have that talking horse car um Bojack where he was like, "Oh, where you been?" Um, you can't just leave people like that. And when you focus on your happiness, that little hamster that was talking to that girl, he said, listen, for a long time, it, it was like I was miserable and I'm finally happy and I finally got peace in my 30s, my 21s. I don't need to explain to nobody what I went through because one, you don't care. And two, I want to be happy. I want to be going to the museum. I want to go have fun. I want to go hang with people that really do care for me and love me. Thank you for becoming a subscriber. You feel me? I, I don't want to be around people that make me feel despair and make me feel less than with the star in reverse. I don't want to be around people that is going to drain my energy. All we got to talk about is money or what we don't have. When we still got time, we got life. The Ten of Pentacles. Your next love life is going to be rich sex. Okay. I'm even getting better with magic. Me and my friend, she does voodoo though. But she really good at magic. She older than me. She don't even make me feel like she more bro. She literally said, bro, with the magic, I did a um protection spell on my subscribers where y'all will always be prosper. So it's like because like I literally did a video where it's like if you think you're gonna hurt my collective or my soul try, you got another things, you're gonna have to get through me. You feel me? Even my man, he could see it. Like he said, your aura be purple, and then it be it be white, and then it be like you an old soul. Like I'm just tired of the bullshit. And my prayers are strong. Where I know when people be manipulating, people being deceptive with the moon card, and then they lying that they're not being deceptive, but they know they are. And it's like even sometimes with my um with my um my best friend homeboy. Because every time when I, I say a prayer and I say, God, when somebody's doing this on purpose, they have a tendency to jump like this, like, and to be like, damn, she knows that I'm doing it on purpose or I'm, I'm doing this out of spite or baby, you're not smart. I've been around the worst narcissistic people you could think of. So I have seen it all. If you hate, if you hate me so much for being smart, hate that ex. And sometimes I got to think that ex. Sometimes I got to think the pain that I went through, because if it wasn't for them pains, if it wasn't for me being aware, baby, I wouldn't see all this bullshit that people people are really showing how narcissistic they are. Come on now. Thank you for joy. Thank you for sunshine. Thank you for rain. We was even dancing in the rain on the beach, in the sand, having fun. It felt so good. Even though I was covering myself with a blanket and I was just dancing like this and just be like, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. It's, it's getting cold. There's also a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius that want to make love to you. Be careful who you share your body with because I feel like they are despair and they think about you in a luxury way. Like somebody's obsessed with your body. If they could, they would eat fruit off of it or whipped cream or whatever you want to you wanna say with the, uh, the eight of cups in reverse. The eight of cups in reverse. 
Oh god. One more card. Clarify that. Yeah, I feel like this person brought a lot of disharmony, a lot of chaos, and then I feel like it's because they was trying to pick you and somebody else. That's what it's giving. And it's like somebody being at your hands and feet with the five of cups. Because they focus on the failure and they just want to make sweet love. No one can do it like you. I almost said cancer, bro. Gemini, Virgo. Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. This has been coming out for a whole damn week. We at Friday. I've been on live three times this week. The highest likes I got was 36,000. We at 22,000. Thank you for the likes. I know that hurt y'all little fingers. Because I used to tap fingers and it, it, it hurts. You feel me with the magician? You are a powerful manifester of when it comes to your par partner. A lot of y'all, if y'all keep saying, I want to have a healthy love or a healthy spouse or somebody who's spiritual, you're going to get that. If you don't, if you've been manifesting, you want someone who's a provider that knows how to be a man. I mean, even my, the people that I went on a double date with, it's like they open the door for their girl, even if the car is raining, even if, um, they, they give each other compliments. So it's like, you know, be careful of, um, be careful of like how you think. You remember I have them other decks where it says like, you know, you're visualizing and praying and making affirmation. And you can't think when you get this new person, they're going to be like your old person. I feel like your new person is going to be very disciplined. Like they're going to meditate. They're going to really get into their spirituality. Somebody already knows they're supposed to be fasting. Somebody knows they're supposed to be in the gym. This person is like going to keep you on your toes and your shit. Okay. I just feel like be careful of a dusty too. There could be also a knight of pentacles. You could tell by their nails not being clean or they sagging their pants trying to sleep with you. And I feel like you're going to reject them and they gonna, you're going to get away from them safely. It's just like how they focus on SEX and this is the first day you met in them. And, you know, they ain't never been tested. You don't even know them. They just focus on lust. Like it's just giving like a lust demon trying to, you know court you so just be careful that like i said somebody's gonna be really shocked like when they come back thinking that you're gonna be sitting there on this shelf sitting here pretty waiting for them and a, another man trash and someone else treasure they think it as a time go by you're gonna be there somebody gonna be snatched up you're gonna be a whole wife you're gonna be having a whole boyfriend somebody gonna be like i thought i thought you know Be also careful of um, posting your relationship because I've been getting that. If you've been feeling like somebody, I'm say it again. If you've been feeling like somebody been sending you dark magic towards your money, get you a double reversal, black and green. If you've been feeling like somebody been sending you EY, get you a double reversal and do an egg cleanse. If you've been feeling like somebody doing chaos magic, trying to make you sick, plot on your relationship, baby, do you a protection spell on your, your love life. Go pay for it on SD. There's spell works. And I literally like to um, do magical flame. I also have another person. But yeah, I already told her. And I don't know how to say her name. It's quite... You, I don't know how to say it. I don't know how to say it. I ain't gonna even try. I gotta go work at literally 9 o'clock, y'all. And I appreciate y'all so much. And I thank you for getting me to 13 hand hearts. And we are just gonna be okay. There's nothing to worry about. It's all coming together for you. I'm hearing Adam Hicks. Somebody could be listening to that. And someone needs to listen to Bad Podcast. Yeah, I will. This is going to be an eight-hour shift. You're welcome. I'm going to put this on um on my YouTube page so anybody needs to see the recap. It was really fun. I like it. Before y'all go to bed, make sure y'all read y'all Psalms 70 and 24. I'm going to say my prayers that I keep in my notes every night for my subscribers. And I'm going to go to sleep. Some of y'all been wanting to have like a day where you go go to a cabin and pray to God for two hours. I feel like whatever money coming in, you're going to have a day or two to pray to God. 
God knows that you want to pray more to him. But I feel like he also hears you when you're praying in the car or when you're at work. So don't think that God don't hear your prayers. All your prayers are being answered. When you see an Amazon delivery truck, that makes my day every time. A Latina woman always tell me that your prayers are answered. And she also told me about these seven knots bracelet for protection. Psalm 70 and Psalms 24. It's very short. It's literally like a little paragraph. Those are the two, because that comes out the that comes out the book of power of Psalms, the power of Psalms. But those two, you can read that. I also like to read Psalms 94, but that's long, baby. And if you got time, hey, go ahead, knock yourself out. Like, comment, subscribe, and hit that notification button. Um, and anybody who's watching this on my YouTube live i mean my youtube channel thank you for supporting and i'll see y'all next time bye